Safe Transfer wish to present to you the procedures and safety guidelines for our four and eight person Safe Transfer personnel baskets. This video should be used as an addition to the written guidelines. A routine check has to be carried out on the basket every day before transfer. Check that lifting sling and compensator are not twisted. We recommend that a toolbox meeting takes place to ensure a safe transfer. It is the employee's responsibility to say so if there is anything they are uncomfortable with. The deck crew must always be in contact with the crane operator. They will know when it is safe to enter the basket. People are not allowed to enter the basket before being told to do so. If a person hasn't used a basket for transfer before, we recommend that he or she is accompanied by an experienced colleague. During transfer, people stand inside the basket like this. Deck crew make sure all straps are closed and tightened before takeoff. In order to ensure that the transport with the basket is as safe as possible, the crane operator always maintains eye contact with the basket and radio contact with the vessel. The crane operator makes sure that the guide ropes are hanging freely during the operation. Transport with basket takes place over open water wherever possible. And people need to wear a life vest as a minimum. If an emergency suit is used, it must be zipped up. Before the basket lands on the deck, people must bend their knees slightly, stay in the basket until the deck crew gives permission to leave it, walk to an area appointed by the crew. If transferred people bring luggage, it must be placed on the floor of the basket. Large amounts of luggage must be transferred separately, not together with people. Only the deck crew are allowed to handle the luggage. The safe transfer basket is a rigid basket and is used worldwide on vessels, platforms and rigs, even in harsh environments such as the North Sea.